Okay, November, some rare games that I think I picked up along the way are Popeye. Not in the best condition, but it will play. It's a good casing, strong. Haunted House. Good condition. Taz. Also in good condition. I've seen Taz at a cheaper price on eBay, but the label was pretty bad. So far I only got I think two that have really bad labels like this. These are the three that I think are in my collection so far that's kind of considered rare. Can cost anywhere from like 40 bucks up to 50 bucks. If you want it cheaper, pick it up because they're pretty expensive on eBay. Taz, I know I think Taz is pretty hard to get. Usually they're around 50 bucks. You can find it cheaper, but probably with a torn label. Oh, I'll still be adding more Atari games to my collection. Uh, so we will be looking forward to next couple months until winter. More of these guys coming up. I might do an individual review on each one as well. I was really happy to see this come in. I never had Popeye. I wish I could find a better condition one, but they're pretty expensive. Better quality, you pay like 60 bucks. So, probably by end of the year or next year, I might update some of the torn labels that I have gotten and update them. Who knows, you might find it for 20 bucks sometimes, you might find it for 10 bucks. Other times you might see it for 50 bucks, 60 bucks, so... That's why sometimes having a loan is good, but... Loan you always pay up. So, bank always makes money on you, so... That's how the bank works. I have one more payment left for my... Games. And I'll have like half a payment after that. So, kind of two payments, but I'll have half of my pay back already by the end of the month. So I'm uh, really happy. I can start thinking about more rare games, bigger games that I could add to my collection, like Hero, which will cost me 80 bucks, I know, between 80 and 100 bucks. But that probably will be around winter time. I'm hoping by the end of the year and see how things go from there with collecting these cartridges. I don't have any that are in a box yet, so that would be considered a rare find. But I know how some people have so many boxes and now, all they send you is just stuff like this. So. Maybe a long time ago, more easier to find boxes, but now, for Atari, not really. So, this game was one of my favorite games when I was younger. I had this as well. And it's a pretty fun, colorful game. You get blown up, and you pick up like food. You just go up and down collecting food. Popeye never had it, so... I looked up gameplay and it was quite interesting. I'd like to have a better quality label though. If I see another one coming up, it's around 20 bucks, 30 bucks, I'll pick it up. Yeah, shipping will probably be another 10 bucks, so uh, keep that in mind. I might have one or two other I consider rare. Pitfall, crackpots, stuff like that. But who knows? See if I could add some more stuff down the line. Thanks for watching.